simple machines. Machines are tools that make our work easier by reducing the amount of force needed to do the work. Machines can be simple or complex. Tools such as scissors, screws, tongs and knives that help us in doing work efficiently and easily are called simple machines. There are six basic types of simple machines. Lever, pulley, inclined, plane, screw wedge and wheel and axle. Complex machines are made of two or more simple machines. For example, a bicycle is a complex machine made up of lever, screw and wheel and axle. Let us learn more about simple machines. A lever is a ridge rod made to rest on and move around the fixed support. It consists of three parts. Fulcrum, it is the fixed point or support on which the rod moves freely. Effort, it is the force that is applied on the free end of the rod to enable the other end to perform work. Load, it is the object on which work has to be done. Depending on the position of these parts, levers are classified into three types. First class, second class and third class. First class. In this type of levers, the fulcrum is between the load and the effort. Some examples are scissors, crowbars, seesaw, and glove hammers. Second class levers. In this type of lever, the load is between the effort and the fulcrum. Some examples are wheelbarrows, bottle openers, and lemon squeezers. Third class levers. In this type of levers, the effort is between the fulcrum and the load. Some examples are a pair of tongues, a stapler, a fishing rod and tweezers. I bought wheel and axle. Wheel and axle is a simple machine in which is attached to a rod called the axle. The wheel and the axle work together. When force is applied to the wheel, the axle turns. Some examples are steering wheels, door knobs and chain wheels. About pulley. A pulley is made up of a small wheel with a groove on its outer edge and a rope or chain running over the groove. The wheel rotates around an axle. They are used to lift weights. They are of two types, fixed and movable. In a fixed pulley, the axle is attached to a support like a hook or wall. It makes work easier by changing the direction of the force applied. Some examples are pulleys used in welds and on flat poles. 
In removable pulley, the axle is not attached to any support and is free to move along with the load. Movable pulleys are used along with fixed pulleys to reduce the effort. An example is cranes used in construction sites to lift heavy loads with less effort. About inclined plane An inclined plane is a slope or a ramp or any slanting surface that helps to carry loads. It requires less force to move an object up an inclined plane than it does to lift the object vertically. Some examples are a slide in the park, ramps in hospitals to push wheelchairs up and down, and ramps for loading and unloading goods on trucks and aeroplanes. About wedge. A wedge is a simple machine made by placing two surfaces, at least one of which is in inclined plane back to back to form a sharp cutting surface. Some examples are cutting edges of knives, needles and axes. About screw. A screw is an inclined plane wrapped around a central cylinder. It is used to hold things tightly together. It can be turned using a screwdriver. Screws are useful in fixing doors, hinges, and handles. Nuts and bolts a dentist's chair. A bottle or toothpaste, cap and screw, jack are all examples of screws.